Hi, we're the Mumfords. Let's have some fun. Today I want to share with you what I got my daughter Karis and my nephew for Easter. Um, I'm going to start with my nephew. He is six years old. First of all, we bought him this bucket that Karis got to decorate with stickers and put his name on it and put whatever stickers she wanted all around it. I thought that was a fun personalized touch. And so, let's see. Let's start with this dog. We got him the Squeaky Minis. It's supposed to look like a balloon pet dog. And so, his name is Healy the Puppy. It says, Pat Me, I Squeak. And also, if you press his nose, he'll repeat what you say in a voice that sounds like he sucked helium. And then if you blow on his nose, he'll make a sound sounding like he's inflating and popping. So I thought that would be really fun since my nephew's really into dogs. To go with the dog theme, I found this DVD called The Dog Who Saved Easter. Um, I've never heard of it, never watched it, but it had really good reviews. And so I thought that would be fun for him to add to his collection of movies. Next, I found this set of Matchbox cars and trucks. I thought he'd really enjoy playing with that. He's really a tractor boy, but I mean, he has dozens and dozens and dozens of John Deere tractors, and I just really don't know what he has in his collection and what he doesn't. So I thought this might be a safer bet that hopefully he doesn't already have this. Next, I have just a set of two bubbles. Um, this I got from Target. It is Sun Squad brand. We've never tried this brand, but the reviews look excellent, saying that the bubbles are long lasting and work well. Then some treats. I found this at Target, a Rice Krispie treat that's frosted, looks like an egg. Thought that was cute and unique. I got him two Kinder Eggs. I'm not sure he's ever had these, but they each have little spring toys in them, I believe. And then he also got a pair of Annie's Bunny Fruit Snacks. So I thought he'd enjoy those too. Um, we have a $30 limit, so I think that's always fun to have an extra surprise for the kids at Easter. Um, the grandparents always spoil the kids, um, but it's also fun just to share our love with our nephew and give him a couple surprises as well. Next, I will move on to my daughter, Karis. She is seven and a half years old. And let me start with the treats. She also has one of these Rice Krispie treats. And then in her bucket, I threw in a Cadbury caramel egg, a Cadbury cream egg, and a Reese's egg. And then the last treat I put in here, I believe, is these Peeps Marshmallow Mellow Delights. They're a little unique because they're dipped in chocolate. So she just particularly like those. And then in her basket, I put this set of bubbles, just like my nephew's. Okay. Now I was thinking I need something a little unique for her basket. Um, last year we kind of went all out and did a lot of American Girl stuff, which you'll see a few little things in here that are American Girl, but I wanted something different. She got her ears pierced last year and she doesn't have too many pairs of unique earrings. So I found these little 
crown earrings. I'm not sure if you can see them, but it says daughter of the king. And I thought that was just very special. I thought she'd really enjoy wearing those. I found her a little bookmark that says, delight yourself in the Lord and he will give you the desires of your heart. Um, last year I got some new magnetic bookmarks and um, she seemed like she really wanted some of her own. So I thought that looked just like her. Then I just got her these stickers that say joy like a fountain. Oh, how he loves us. Be joyful in hope. Um, she likes to journal and decorate her journal um, with washi tape and other stickers. So I thought these would be perfect for her journaling. Then I found this book. I believe it's new. Yes, it is. It's called Betty Confetti, an inspirational story about God at work, written by Megan Taylor. So... I'll just read you a little bit on the back in case you're interested if you have a daughter or a little girl to shop for. It says, Betty loves to create art, yet when she tries her hardest, she makes mistakes. But that doesn't stop Betty. She finds a surprising way to turn her mistakes into beauty and fun. And she learns that when we give our imperfections to God, he will make something beautiful out of them. I thought that sounded like something Karis would really enjoy reading. And then, something I've never given her before is a set of her own stationery. It says, love becomes its fullest when it's shared. Um, if you know Karis's personality, she is a giver, she is an encourager, she just loves to be kind to other people. Um, since she was about three or four, she used to draw these beautiful pictures and write just encouraging words to friends, family, strangers, and it just really can cheer up somebody's day. So I thought giving her her own set of stationery would be fun. And maybe we can um, have some time this summer to write notes to some friends and family who may maybe live far away from us or that we can't get together with. All right, a few American Girl things, because that is her number one passion in life. Um, she doesn't really play with toys all that much, um, but American Girl, <laughs> number one in her life. The one thing that she keeps saying she wants is Courtney's workout outfit. Courtney is the American Girl 80s doll. Um, she's the first doll they came out with that I wanted. <laughs> I was born in the 80s and I just think she's precious. So this is her workout outfit. And then she also has an Irish doll named Nellie. It's Samantha's best friend. And so they just came out with these world traveler outfits. And so this is the world traveler in Ireland outfit. I thought that was really cute and right up her alley. And then the last little outfit for her dolls is a Joss um, casual beach outfit. She also has Joss. So, and then something free that I got with my order is, it says Courtney's mixtape, but in it is a little um, hair scrunchie for her doll, Courtney, and a matching one for Karis. So she's really gonna like that. I don't think she's ever seen it before, so she'll be surprised. All right. Last is just a couple clothing items that I found for her. This is an American Girl dress. Um, it matches one that she already has for her Truly Me doll. I don't think she's ever seen that it comes in girl sizes too. So I think she's going to have a lot of fun matching her doll with that. And then the last little outfit I found, I was at Target today. And I saw this jumper dress and I, it just looks like something she would love to wear. She loves dresses of all sorts. And then I found this glittery tank top to go under it. I don't know if you can see it, but there's specks of silvery glitter all over it. So that's to go under it. So that is all I have for these two precious kids in my life. Um, 
I love seeing Easter hauls on other people's videos, so I hope you got some good ideas from these. Um, and if not, you can always use them for birthdays or Christmas in the future. And I hope that you and your family all have a beautiful Easter too. Talk to you later.